Well, Chautauqua County, like much of the United States, is experiencing a shortage in operating farms and a loss of farmlands. And to combat this, the county now adopting a new agricultural development and enhancement strategy. Our Alyssa Wright joining us live in studio now with more on what this means for local farmers here. Alyssa? Justin, numerous farmers in the region have faced developmental pressures regarding their farmland and are now beginning to speak out about how important preserving farmland really is for the economy and for everyday life. I've been working with um, the county's Department of Planning and Development and uh, over the last probably 10 years to kind of look at the last plan, what was effective in it, what wasn't, and then making plans for the new one. Farming is a big part of Chautauqua County, which is why the resource needs to be protected. I think one of the most important things is that it brings to people's attention the need to protect our, our farmland in the county. And there are certain development pressures um, depending on the area you live in. Our environment here in Chautauqua County is, is spectacular. And it's spectacular because of the open fields. And, um, and our agricultural industry is extremely large in Chautauqua County. And it's, it's important to um, keep that viable and keep that um, as an economic growth in our county because it's what we do well and it's what we've done well for a long time. Many farms have succumbed to the developmental pressures recently, and the reason why is simple. It's much easier sometimes when the pressures come in to say, you know, I've been working really hard at this, and now they're offering me 10 times what I will ever make in farming, um, you know, to develop the land. And uh, we can't have that happen, or we're going to, to lose the opportunity to produce high-quality food um, for all the consumers. We've just recently have... Uh... Uh, Love's Truck Stop just as came to town um, on the throughway entrance here in Ripley and who knows what additional development pressure that may bring to the area and the farmland specifically. Land Protection Plan has been reworked over the past decade. The County Department of Planning and Development used a $50,000 grant from New York and a $30,000 grant from the Chautauqua Region Community Foundation to update this plan. Reporting live in the studio, Alyssa Wright, WNY News, now.